this is a van I bought spares or repair it was cheap it had got um, an electronic fuel pump problem the VP30 pump um, had given up the ghost uh, I bought it off a magician he couldn't get it going you can see the magic circle stickers on the side and also if you look down there you can see where some of the other lettering was I don't know whether the camera will pick it up but it says on the top magic and illusion juggling fire eating unicycling and stilt walking well I was gonna try and fix it up cheap but the replacement VP30 pumps very expensive and I don't really like electronics it's they're hard to fix it costs you a fortune to plug them into a diagnostic machine if you replace the pump you have to get it coded to the ECU and I don't like that uh, I want something cheap so I decided to try and fit a good old-fashioned mechanical fuel pump gets rid of all the electronics no more hassle well the pump I first put on it was a Land Rover 200 TDI pump which is like that one there but that didn't work very well some of the internal components weren't quite right so I've got loads of old pumps lying around that have been taken off scrap vehicles so I got all of them for free this is one off the VP this is a VP 30 that was on the van originally I just pulled it apart to see how it worked it's the same as these but there's nothing in there I could use so we had a look round and decided to see if we can make a better one out of bits we've got parts that we thought were more suitable uh, that's off a transit that's another Land Rover one but the case isn't very good so we didn't use that uh, that's off a six cylinder Volvo which would be no good at all that's off a Montego, didn't use any of that that one there is an Iveco but we managed to put something together that performs a lot better so as far as that's concerned happy days right here we are we'll have a look under the bonnet um, after a bit of bracket making and a bit of machining on the hub uh, we had to alter the mounting flange a bit um, there it is if you can see it it's in there somewhere um, a VE pump mechanical pump no electronics to go wrong the only thing you need is one wire to the stop solenoid and that's it um, oh there's some wires off there but we don't need those do we um, we might as well try and start it up Ooh, we better make sure it's out of gear there we go the tachometer flicks but it doesn't work when you rev it up but we'll go around and have a look at the engine there Oh, there it is. It runs all right. I just stick my hand in and rev it up. Just to prove it's not electronic. Um, it's done 5,000 miles. It's running really well. So there we are. Maybe I'll show you a bit later. I'll pull this off and you can have a look. But we might as well go for a ride. Yeah. Are, we, are we rolling? He says recording. Yeah. All oh, right. Off we go then. Off we go, mate. Right, yeah. okay. right. Go for a drive. All right. She's running all right. Good. Weasel about a turbo boost. <laughs> oh yes. Got 20 pounds. It's a bit more than standard. I think we'd have been in lift mode by now. <laughs> Dipping, so we're actually going a bit faster than we thought, but we're uphill now, so there's the 
garage where it got MOT. <laughs> Oh well. 